show that's just a little bit different. That's why we call it Off the Wall. Now, back from his five-year mission to explore strange new worlds, our host, Larry Zeno. Hi, everybody. Thank you, Kelly, and welcome to Disney's Off the Wall. Are you guys ready to set this place on fire? Yeah. All right. Let me hear it nice and loud from the blue team, Natalie. Warren and Seth. And their opponents on the gold team, Alexa, David, and Gina. Today, these two teams are going to be going up against any one of these nine video challengers that the lovely Kelly found at the happiest place on earth. Disneyland! <laughs> now, after three rounds, the team that earns the most points will go on to play in our Off the Wall Ultimate Showdown for a chance to win a stereo system with the five disc CD changer. <laughs> now, blue team, gold team, listen up, guys, because one of these video challengers up on the wall is today's double trouble player. Now, what you want to do is pick that person play against that person and beat that person, because when you do, you're going to pick up double the points in that round. Speaking of rounds, we're about to go into round number one, and it looks like the gold team won the coin toss. They'll be going first, each rally worth 100 points. Hello, Alexa. Welcome to the show. So um, what do you do for athletics? You're a pretty good... Uh... Well, I like the outdoors and hiking. You like to hike? Wow, so you go camping? Where do you hike at? Um, mainly around Malibu and Santa Monica Mountains. Wow, that sounds fun. You might as well hike in the prettiest place on Earth. So wait, it's your turn to choose a challenger. Who do you want to play against off the wall? I'll choose number five. Number five, let's meet your video challenger. Hi, what's your name? Alana Taylor. How old are you, Alana? I'm 14 and a half. And do you get a lot of homework at school? Yeah, about three hours Ugh. every day. Yuck. Mm -hmm. Well, if you ever get finished with all that homework and have some free time, what do you like to do? I go shopping or I go um, I go on the computer and I do AOL. Yeah, do you talk to my friends. Talk to all your friends all over yeah. the place, huh? Well, do you ever decide, you know what, I just think I want to relax on the beach? Sometimes. Well, guess what? I've got a game for you, but Alana, it's no day at the beach. What do you think? <laughs> I'll try it. All right. So have you ever walked on the beach and hiked on there? Yeah. Want to say? Cool. You'll be ready for this next stunt. Follow me. Yeah. Over here. All right. So you ever walk along and you're like, oh my gosh, look, I found a straw. <laughs> That's you're gonna play the game that we call the Sandy, Sandy Beach Scavenger Dig Guy. Dig it, dig it, dig it. All right. So let's go ahead and kneel down with me right here. Okay, now when I say go, I'm gonna show you an object. I'm gonna place it right there, and you have to find that object. When you do, set it up there, I'll brush them away, and I'll give you another object and you keep going and you find as many as you can in 30 seconds. Do you have any questions? No. All right, this worth 100 points. Let's get ready. Okay, let's count her down and give her some support. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Find that bat. Good, find that ball. Good, find that bird. Good, find this quarter. Stand up. Now, I guess you have dug on the beast before because you got it. eight right. Great job, Alexa. Let's see how you did a challenge it is. Five, congratulations. You picked up 100 points. Go ahead and join the gold team. Now it's the blue team's turn. Hello, Natalie. Welcome to the show. So, um, you like to do what? You like to? I like swimming. You like swimming. Wow. Do you swim competitively or? No. He's like, just swim. Yeah. Hang out over summertime, do backflips, belly yeah. flops, all that kind of stuff. Yeah. That's cool. Anybody else like to do that? Yeah. All right. It's your turn to choose a challenger. Who do you want to play against off the wall? Number six. Number six. Let's meet your video challenger. And your name is? Chuck. Chuck, what do you do for a living? I'm an industrial engineer. Yeah, and what do you do for fun? 
Oh, water skiing, snow skiing, playing with the kids is my favorite hobby. Oh, really? That's always a good thing to do. Well, let me ask you this. Chuck, I know we don't know each other that well, but would you mind if I called you Annette? Well, if you don't tell the guys at work, I guess. Okay, well, Chuck, how about I just give you Annette for this next time? Okay, my, my mother-in-law would like that. Her name's Annette. <laughs> All right, are you ready for your challenge? Good, follow me, Natalie. It's right over here. Okay. For you, we've got a very special game, and we call it the Confounding Fly Flip into Nasty Nugget Food. Okay, so I'm going to demonstrate what you're going to do. Now, whether I do it or not is a different question, but you're going to take this fly catching device. You're going to take this nice fly. You'll stick him on the end of the board, okay? And you have to make sure that when you catch it, at least one foot or both is past this green line. So it's something like this. Oh. All right. So, that's what you want to do. Now, you want to get as many flies into your net by flipping them up into the air as you can in 30 seconds. So, you have 30 seconds to catch as many flies as you can. Do you have any questions, Natalie? No. All right, go ahead and take your net. There you go. You want to put it in the other hand? Or... Okay, you can start right there. Remember, your first fly is already set for you. There you go. Everybody, let's count her down. You might want to put that in the other hand. <laughs> Here we go, everybody. Let's count her down. Here we go. And... Four, three, two, one, go, go, go. There you go, there you go, now you got it. Go, go, go. There you go, there you go. Smack them in the air. Hit him. Oh, there we go. All right, hit him with the other foot if you have to. All right, there you go, 12 seconds. Oh, there we go. You got that backwards, there we go. Whoa. Let's see how you did. Looks like they're all going to count. Great job. Let's see. Let's go ahead and dump them out. Eh. You've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Hanging on the end of the net. Let's see how you're going to challenge you, dude. Six to five. You beat him by one foot. You picked up 100 points. Hey, shot. Now we're going to go and join your blue team. All right. That was the end of round number one. And the scores are the blue team with 100 points. <laughs> the gold team with 100 points. <laughs> we have a tie. Don't go away, everybody. We'll be right back with more fly action right here at Off the Wall. Don't go away. Off the Wall will be right back. Tomorrow, come on down to Magical World of Disney, because if you want dogs, we got two movies that will give you your pick of a litter. You're joking, right? No, sorry, Bob. You want dancing dogs? We well, got those. How about sheep dogs? Dogs that like to play games or even dogs that think they're turkeys? Gobble, gobble, gobble. Yep, we got them too. Are you looking for a dog who thinks he's a human, or maybe just a human who thinks he's a dog? I'm oh, fine, fine. Just looking for a bone. Gosh, aren't they cute? You can get your pick of the litter by watching Rubber Danger Field, followed by Disney's You Lucky Dog. Just what we need more dogs. Tomorrow, on Magical World of Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. Saturday, September 19th at 7, 6 Central on Magical World of Disney. We've got a Saturday premiere cruising your way. It's the latest Disney original music special, Cleopatra in Concert, from aboard Disney's new cruise ship, Disney Magic. Meet the girls from their beginning. Then join them aboard Disney Magic for their first ever television concert special. It's a Saturday premiere, Cleopatra in Concert. Don't miss the magic! Saturday, September 19th at 7, 6 Central. Only on Disney! It's summer, and all the kids are surfing. Zoo Disney! Uh, excuse me, MZ, what is Zoo Disney? Well, Zoo Disney's TV. Zoo Disney's online. Zoo Disney's a title I will tell off you, John. It is as much on TV as it is online. You see, on Sundays, you watch two hours of stuff on TV. Fun oh, juice, new episodes going wild, Jeff Corwin, and brand new game show, Mad Lips. Then I take TV stuff and put it online. This is where we need your help. Seatbelts, everyone. We surf on over to Zoo Disney's Ether, home of the zoos. And you do stuff, play games, tell us what you think, join clubs, and talk to other kids. Then Zooks take stuff you did online back to the TV. Now here comes the tricky part. Everybody, stand by for the tricky part! On Saturday, we're going to put the stuff you did online back onto the show. How I did. It. You see, Zoo Disney isn't just TV you watch, it's TV you do! And the more you do, the better it's going to get. Zoo Disney, weekend starting at 5, 4 central, only on Disney. 
we now return to Off the Wall, right here on Disney. Welcome back to Off the Wall, everybody. Thank you for tuning in. Right now, I'm going to reveal the scores. They are the blue team with 100 points. And the gold team with 100 points. We have a tie, ladies and gentlemen. Right now, we're going to go ahead and start round number two. And in this round, every single game is going to be worth 200 points. They start. Now, blue team, gold team, remember up, guys, because we still have somewhere hiding on the wall, our double trouble player. And you've got to find them and beat them, because right now, in this round, they're worth 400 points. Now, we still have seven video challengers left up on our wall. It looks like the gold team is up. Hello, David. Do you mind if I call you David? No. No? OK. So uh, it looks like you're a pretty good dancer, I hear. Really? Um, you like yeah. to dance? Yeah. So maybe we'll get you to dance later on. OK. First of all, it's your turn to choose a challenger. Who do you want to play against off the wall? Number seven. Number seven. Oh, double trouble, David. Double trouble. Nice. Let's go ahead and meet your double trouble player. Go ahead, Mr. Hi, what's your name? Tara. Where are you from, Tara? Irvine. California? Yeah. Tara, what's your favorite meal of the day? I like dinner the best. Oh, yeah? Well, how do you feel about breakfast? It's all right. You can take it or leave it? Yeah. Well, I hope you take it this time because we've got a breakfast game that's really going to fill you up. How does that sound? It sounds all right. All right. So, my friend David, are you ready? Yeah. Follow me out. All right. So, uh... Before we get going on this next game, you said you were a good dancer, is that right? Yeah. Really? Like Kick it! Ah! <laughs> All right. Ladies and gentlemen, David. Nice job. Now you have big smart IQ for this next game. You're going to play the Bagel oh! Mouth Transfer to Infinity and Beyond. Oh! All right. So here's what you're going to do. You're going to put your hands behind your back when I count you down and say go. You're going to grab these bagels one at a time with your teeth. Grab them over here and squish them over so they slide on here. Now, whoever can get the most bagels transferred with their mouth from here to here in 30 seconds is going to win. Do you have any questions? No. No. Remember, this is your double trouble, David. It's worth 400 points. Are you ready? Yeah. All right, don't start until we say go. Everybody, let's cheer them on for this double trouble challenge. And here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Go, David, go. Go, 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 go. Come on over, right over here. So let's see, that one counted at the buzzer, good. So you've got one, two, three, four the bagels, great job. The seven of challenger did. Three, nice, you beat her by one bagel, David. Go and join your team. Congratulations, that was worth 400 points. Now let's go ahead and give the blue team a shot to catch up. Hello, welcome to the show, Lauren. So you do something that actually you might be able to compete in the Olympics for, what's that? Rhythmic gymnastics. Rhythmic gymnastics. Wow. So how long have you been doing that? A while. Oh, Ohio. So do you want to compete in the Olympics someday? No. No? Okay. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Well, you are competing here, and it is your turn to choose a challenger. So who do you want to play against off the wall? Number two. Number two? Wow. Let's meet your video challenger. Hi, what's your name? My name's Ryan. And where are you from, Ryan? I'm from Abbotsford, BC, Canada. Oh, all the way in Canada. That's great. Now, um, are you ready to play this next game? I'm ready for any game. You know, I've got a little bit of bad news for you. With this next game, we're going to leave you up a creek with a paddle. What do you think about that? Huh? All right. So, are you ready for your challenge? Yeah. Good. Follow me, Lauren. Right over here. Okay, for you, we've got a very special game because, you know, 
you're into the whole gymnastics thing, and we've actually got someone here that's good at spinning, and we call this game the Rotating Human Stick of Frame Radapalooza! Okay, so what you're gonna do, now we have over here, this is Devin, who is the evil twin brother of Kevin. <laughs> Kevin is at Disneyland and his evil brother is here, but don't worry, you, because he's evil, you get to hit these balls at him twice as hard. Yeah. That's the fun part. So what you're gonna do, he's gonna be spinning, we're gonna count you down, you've gotta use this boom paddle and stick as many balls in him as you can. Please, start spinning, evil Devin. We're gonna take these balls and go, boom, you see? Watch when he comes up, whoa! Nice! So if you can get more balls stuck to Devin over there in 30 seconds, you're gonna win. Do you have any questions? No. Okay, don't start swatting at him until we say go. Everybody, this is worth 200 points. Count her down, here we go. And five, four, three, two, one, go! Go, yeah, there's one. Oh! Oh! Nice and hard, get him at him. Devin and see how you did. So we've got one, two, three, four. Four balls stuck to a mess nice up one. Let's see how you're gonna challenge it in. Fourteen. Wow, he just had good luck. Don't worry about it. Nice try, Lauren. <laughs> Devin, where are you going? All right, that was the end of round number two. And the scores are the blue team with 100 points. And the gold team with 500 points. Firstly in the lead. We're gonna start round number three. This is our head-to-head -head challenge. And are you guys ready for this or what? All right, I hope so, I know I am. Let me explain to you what's gonna be happening. This is the only part of the game where our final two players will be playing against each other at the same time. Not only that, they're also gonna be going against our video challenger. Let me tell you the way I'm gonna award the points. If either team beats their video challenger, they're gonna receive 300 points. And for beating their opponent, they will receive another 250 points. So right now, just because it's so close, we have 550 points at stake. Let's go and get our final two players. That's a center stage. Come on up, come on up. Come up, Steph, come on up, Gina, right over here. All right, guys, so you guys are going to be going up against each other in the in the head-to-head uh, -head challenge. Just yeah. look, at, look at each other, guys. Look at you. Are you guys ready? Are you ready? Yeah. I want a nice, clean competition. I don't want any funny business, all right? Are you guys ready? Yeah. Let's meet your video challenger. Hi, what's your name? Eric. Hey, Eric, how you doing? Fine. Eric, what is your favorite pastime? TV. TV, so you'd say you kind of have a head for TV, TV trivia stuff. Exactly. Yeah, um, how about sports? You like any sports? Yeah. Would you say maybe basketball? Yeah. Think you really got a head for basketball? Sure. All right. So guys, you got these baskets on your head. You know what that means? That means you're playing the game that we call the basket head of unwavering. Joy, joy, joy. All right. So this is what you guys want to do. And you've got to get as many of these items up into your basket as you can in 30 seconds. And there's only one major rule that I have. We don't want any <laughs> slam dunking like that. You can actually throw them from about here. So it's like, whoop, just like that. Now you guys want to get as many of these into your basket as you can and do not start until we all scream, go! Are you guys ready? Yeah! All right, here we go. This is our head to head challenge. Count them down and five, four, three, two, one, go! Go, 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 toss them up. Your 
this last one at the buzzer will not count. We'll take it out. But you bend over, we'll see how you did. One, two, three, four, five total. Nice job. You all right? All right. Let's see how you did. You got it. Whoa. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight total. Nice job. So, Seth, looks like you beat Jenner for 250 points. Eight was the highest one the CAV Challenger did. 19. I didn't even know that was humanly possible. I guess he's inhuman. That's all right, guys. You did great. Go ahead and join your teams. All right. That was an awesome end to round number three. And the final scores are the blue team with 350 points. And the gold team with 500 points. Congratulations, gold team. Blue team, you guys tried very hard. Nice job at the end with all the balls. You did great. Now, this is going to be a very fun time for you because I'm giving you all passports to Disneyland. You can check out tomorrow at the Magic Kingdom. Thanks for playing, guys. Gold team, congratulations. You guys won the blue team, and you're going on to play in a ultimate showdown. And you guys want the grand prize, right? You guys still want the big prize, like the grandola prize? Well, let me tell you. There's one person standing in your way, and I'm going to choose them from the Magic Fishbowl. It just appears to me miraculously for no apparent reason. David, actually, no, Gina, you did a great job. Plus, you have a bask on her head. Will you choose the person you're playing against? There you go. Thank you. She didn't try and read it. I should let her win just for that. All right. And the lucky studio audience player that may try and take your grand prize is in seat number 62, Dennis. Yes, Dennis, have a seat. Have a seat, Dennis. Congratulations, Bennett! Everybody jumps away because Bennett is going off the wall against the gold team in just a second in our ultimate showdown! Don't go away. Off the wall, we'll be right back. Tonight on Magical World of Disney, you want goals? Yeah, man. Disney's got them times two. Scoring goals, setting goals, defending goals, achieving goals. That's my boy! Watch four friends fix on the goal of skating from the soul. Let's go show them what soul skating's all about. In Disney's new original movie, Brink. Go figure. Then, want to play some hockey? The Ducks must score goals, stop goals, and set some goals. Are you ready to fly? Yeah! To reach their goal of the gold in D2 The Mighty Ducks. Tonight? Yeah, tonight on Magical World of Disney. Movies at 7, 6 Central. Sunday, on another episode of Bug Juice, our summer at camp. Keisha, Keisha, will you go hand out the song? Lauren's planning a special campfire. I'm not writing a speech. I'm saying so. We already wrote the speech. But tension mounts. We got Mom, I want to come home. As the event proves to be a bigger challenge than expected. We all come here as like separate people with separate personalities. Will the campers get it together in time? I know a cabin cannot work without unity. Sunday at 505, 405 Central, inside Zoop Disney. Hey Disney! Hey Disney! Hey Disney! Jump right in! Jump! Jump! Jump right in! Disney wants you to jump right in! Jump on the sidewalk! Jump to the yard! 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 See anything different about Jeff Corwin this season? Well, Jeff Corwin still takes you to places like Baja, Costa Rica, Venezuela, and Zoo Disney. Jeff Corwin still knows stuff about animals, like the howler monkey and two-toed sloth. Zooks too, like that's Gather and that's Joe. Jeff Corwin's still going wild, but at a new time. Going wild with Jeff Corwin, now at 625, following Mad Libs inside Zoo Disney. Every Saturday and Sunday. New adventures, new times, same Jeff. Going wild with Jeff Corwin, on air, online, inside Zoo Disney. We now return to Off the Wall, right here on Disney. Hey everybody, welcome back to Off the Wall. I'm here with my winners, the gold team, and they're going to take on our ultimate showdown! Woo! Love that part. <laughs> Just a second ago, Dennis was uh, picked for a magic fishbowl from the audience. And he's going to be taking on all the members of the gold team at the same exact time. Dennis, are you ready? Yeah. Gold team, can you beat Dennis? Yeah. Oh, gold team, can you beat Dennis? Yeah. All right, follow me, 
guys? Let's get one each face in. One, two, three. Guys, so your faces are nice and tough, right? This one hurt when you clip them on there. Let me see. Tell me if this hurts. That hurt? No, because you're going to play the game that we call the Terrifying Close Being Clubs of Facial Distortion! Didn't hurt that. Well, of course, that's the fun part. Okay, so guys, what you have to do is we have 15 clips inside of this bowl. Now, you have to get all of those clips attached to your face to win the grand prize. All 15. Do you guys have any questions? As fast as you can and don't start until we say go. Everybody count it down. This is our ultimate showdown end for the grand prize. Here we go. And five, four, three, two, one, go. Go, guys, go, go, go. On your ears, on your lips, on your nose, on your lips, on your lips. Gina, you won! Nice job! Hey, Dennis, first of all, you look great, man. Second of all, we're gonna give you some passports to Disneyland so you can go to Tomorrowland, have a fun day at the Magic Kingdom. Thanks for playing, Dennis. Hey, guys, congratulations, because you know what? For beating the blue team, you guys got some portable CD players, and for beating Dennis, you guys picked up a stereo system with the five disc CD changers! Nice! Guys, want to go ahead and take off your, uh... there you go. Does that feel better? Pain is your friend. There we go. Nice job, David. Everybody, you guys did amazing. You know what? Do you guys realize what just happened? You guys won the show. You guys got some CD players. You guys got all kinds of fun stuff. You guys are going to go to Disneyland. You guys are having a great time. I know you guys all want to come down and play this game because it's so much fun, but not everybody can play here. But you can play along with us at your house just by clipping some of these things to your face like this and by getting some work and sticking it like right here. It's fun. You guys can do all kinds of fun stuff and have a good time all the time because we always have fun here on Off the Wall. Next, get ready for the game that inspires you to play. It's Disney's new original game show, Mad Libs, right here only on Disney.